A Hendersonville man accused of setting fire to the Nashville courthouse already is facing federal arson charges. That was news that came down today. U.S. Attorney Don Cochran made that announcement this morning. Our Carice Jackman actually spoke with him. She joins us live from downtown Nashville here this afternoon. Carice. Yeah, you know, Lauren, Cochran says, look, he understands people want to protest and protest peacefully. But when you create acts of violence or vandalism like what we saw behind us here at the courthouse, he says then they have to take legal action against you. Now, U.S. Attorney Cochran says that the criminal complaint was issued today charging 25-year-old Wesley Somers with malicious destruction of property using fire and explosives. The incident happened Saturday following the peaceful rally and protest downtown. Officials say Somers is allegedly depicted in video clips and pictures showing him holding an object that was set on fire and accuses him of placing it through the window of the courthouse. If convicted, the U.S. attorney says Sombers faces a mandatory minimum of five years and up to 20 years in prison. To light a courthouse on fire in the guise of uh, protesting police misconduct was so far over the line. Uh, and there is a federal statute that prohibits that. So for all those reasons, we felt this was an appropriate case to bring these kind of charges. Now, we also heard of additional arrests related to what happened here at the courthouse. We asked Cochran about that. He says they obviously have to follow federal guidelines. But, yes, the investigation to all of this remains ongoing. Back to you.